As you can see, I'm not lying. She's not lying. Who's lying? Not me. What's up, Bougie? And welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kieran. I'm coming back to you with another one. Yes, another one. And in today's video, I'm going to talk about my favorite makeup brushes that I use to achieve just about all of my makeup looks. So if you want to know what's some dope, cheap affordable makeup brushes and you just gotta keep watching but before we go ahead and keep watching please be sure to hit the subscribe button hit the bell to set up notifications and make sure you give this video a thumbs up let's go ahead and get right into this video all right y'all so let's go ahead and get right into it i'm going to start with my eyebrows my eyes and then just you know the way i do my makeup so let's go ahead and get right into it so let me see okay so starting with my eyebrows, because I do use an eyebrow pomade, I love using this BH Cosmetics brush. And it don't really have, it just says, okay, it has V10. And it looks like this, it has the little, the little brush, and then it has the little spoolie on the other side. I absolutely really love this brush. I don't know what I would do without it. I need to order some more because that's how much I really love this brush. And then after that, for my concealer, I do use, my mind is brushes y'all, disclaimer, I just fixed my makeup, so disclaimer. Um, this is my concealer brush, but pretty honestly, you can all, you can go and get a flat brush anywhere, honestly, like, for real. And this is the BH Cosmetics brush, and this is in the number 7. I really love this brush, it gives you like that flat surface, and then you can make it even more flatter as well, um, to give you that, you know, to be able to conceal your eyebrows period and then once i'm done with that i love going in with my um morphe m173 brush nope i love going in with my elf contour brush and it's like this and it's like it gives you that little thickness to it so that you can just like blend in your like blend your uh, concealer out around your eyebrows and then i got this little cheap um this little cheap brush i think i got a set of these off of amazon but it gives you like that thickness now what i do now use the substitution is the morphe m173 brush because this one is getting like old so i do now use this one but i just want to tell you that you could use a cheaper one and once again this one is the morphe m173 brush i use this to like kind of like blend it in even more so those are some very very good brushes and then after that, going down to my um, my eyes, I honestly, I just use, um, if you're going for like a simple look, I use the BH Cosmetics V5. It's like a very, very fluffy brush. Then I use uh, BH uh, Cosmetics number no. 5 brush. It's a fluffy brush as well. Honestly, you can use any brushes to achieve your your eyeshadow. Like you don't have to go. You can go get a set off of Amazon. Let's just be honest, and you you can get some you can get some good looks off of that. Honestly. So after the, after that, and moving on to like <clears throat> and moving on to my face for my foundation brush. I love y'all. So basically, okay. So for my foundation brush, I love to use this um uh, elf foundation flat brush this is what i use to pump the foundation onto or people pump it on their hand but i like using this so i can just like spread it down my face just like that and then i go in with the goat i go in with the goat and this is the morphe e63 brush y'all this brush came out when the morphe came out with the no filter uh foundation and i scooped these up mm -hmm. so this brush, yes, it came out when uh, Philip Morphe came out with that foundation. And once again, this is the Morphe E63 brush. This brush I use to um, blend in my foundation. I really, really love this brush. I feel like if you don't have this in your collection, this would be one of the ones that you should most definitely, definitely pick up for that foundation, baby. Yes. And then, after that, for my, uh, to blend in like my concealer, I do like using a sponge. And this is actually like the F Camel sponge. I really love this sponge. It's so 
you know you can get in all the, the creases and all that kind of stuff i really could just like so squishy and you can go like this you can flip it around like, i really do like this one and then to also blend in my foundation i forgot to mention i do use this sonia cashette brush i do use this sonia cashette um sponge to just to pat in all my areas once i'm done blending in with the brush i do go in with a sponge just you know to make sure you got all make sure you got it real good i really love this this sponge once again this is the sonia catch it sponge i probably said her name wrong but you can get this from uh target now after i did my foundation i put my concealer on i'm going to go ahead and talk about my uh my um uh, real techniques um setting brush i use i got okay i use two of them so i use one of them for my uh one of my setting powders and i use one other one for my other setting powders and then i use this uh elf flawless concealer brush now this is a concealer brush but i also use this as a setting brush as well it works really good so you can go with either three, either one of these. These are the same. So either two of these, and they will give you that flawless look. As you can see, I'm not lying. She's not lying. Who's lying? Not me. So yes. <laughs> and then after I put my um, setting powder on, I do go in using my Elf Complexion Duo Brush. I like it because I can dust this off, and then you know, like how you might got some powder like in the crease. Baby, this brush right here can go like this again, right there, and then dust it away, y'all. Period. And once again, this is the Elf Complexion Duo Brush. Okay. Now, once I'm done with that, I do go in for my contour. I use this is really like no name brush. I I got. I think I got this off of Amazon. Like I know we all know this brush, Amazon. Look, you can get this from anywhere, kind of like. And it's like a brush like that. So it gives you like, like that type of thing. Like a some turn to the side. So it's really like, I can't even explain it. But cause I can do like this and dab it in just like that. So I really, really love this brush. And then um, for my, uh, for my blush, I like using a big, a big br brush. This has no name. I got it the same, the same thing. But I like use like a big one because it's like puffy. And you could be like this and you could just pat it in and smile and say cheese for the camera. And then you just, you know, like that. And then I love using this uh, FEMA fig. My price said around 103 brush for my highlight. And it looks like that. So you want to use a brush that's like this because you can go like, I find it for me more easier to go like this and this and then like this you know what i'm saying um so yes and then after that what i like to use to um bronze all over my face i love using this elf flawless face brush it's a big puffy brush now you can probably use this for your blush as well but i love using it for my powder to powder all over my face i really 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 love that especially when i, when I feel like i'm getting like shiny or something like that i love this brush so much okay and then another good brush that you can another good brush that you can use for your foundation like if you don't really like this this type of brush then you can use the elf ultimate blending brush i really really love this brush that you can use for your foundation i love this brush so much i feel like that this will be a good investment for you as well and then also if you can't find like um a brush for the uh contour you can always go in with the elf sculpting face brush and it looks like this so it's kind of like the same and it give you that nice flawless um contour line but not too harsh but harsh but not too harsh you get it but yes y'all these are all of my favorite favorite brushes that i really really love to use and i kind of use them like in all of my videos that i have basically put on um that i basically put on uh youtube so thank y'all so much for watching this video please be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to see those notifications and i will see you on my next one peace out